Okay, so now that you know how to make a website and how to change your background, I'm going to show you how you can add different types of pages to your website. So that's the edit button. This is the gear button, which shows you how to edit the layout and manage the site. But this button right here, the create page button, is what we're going to focus on right now. So hit create page, and I have to name my page. So we'll call this page example list. And rather than use just a blank web page like my home page, I'm going to change it to a list. And I'm going to put my list under the home page. That way it just gets nested under it. It's not its own like separate thing. Uh, I'll show you what that looks like in a moment. Then I hit create. Now, there are different types of lists that I can make but I like this create your own. So I'm going to click this create own and now I get to name my columns. So let's go with name, a lot of column. We'll go with uh, subject. I'll make a list of teachers in the building. Add another column, room number. We'll add another column email, add another column, website. Okay, and then I'm going to hit save. Now all of this is going to go away and here are the subjects, the identifiers that I just put in to my site. Now to add an item to this list, I'll click add item. Name, Mr. Benora, subject, technology, room number, m-2, email espinora at runamedeschools.org, and as far as my actual website is concerned, let's see if we can find it. There it is. So I just grab that link, and I'll paste it there. All right, and save. And now, there is my website. Now I can click on this and I can edit. When I have more I can sort by subject, room number, I can sort by email address or name. And that's how you make a list. Another page, All right, actually you know what, let's go to the home page because my list isn't over here. So I'm gonna go to my gear I'm going to go to Edit Site Layout. I'll click on Navigation, and I want to add a page to the navigation. Recent Changes. That's my example list. OK. Now example list is here. So now, if I click Close, I can click on Example List. And that's pretty much it.